Hello YouTube, my name is Master Rolfus, and we're playing Homeworld 2 Remastered, which is a sequel to Homeworld 1, obviously, and takes place about, I think, a couple centuries in the future, actually. There is a game, I think, that takes place in between Homeworld 1 and Homeworld 2 called Cataclysm. Actually, that could take place after Homeworld 2. I don't, I don't know. It's a lot of Homeworlds. Uh, yeah, I did play some practice missions here and there. Well, not really practice missions. Yeah, I completed them, and I already did the recording. I just need to re-record episode 1 because something fucked up. Because I fuck up everything I touch. Because every single time I touch, I get this feeling. In the first time, the great hyperspace core was found. With it came the gift of interstellar travel, and the Outer Rim trade routes were established, uniting the galaxy in peace. thousand years passed before the second core was discovered on a desert planet. Pain and bloodshed flowed in its wake. But the exiles returned to their homeworld, Higara. A young woman led them across the galaxy, and it is she who will lead them again. Her name is Karen Sajet. This is the story of the end time. We know this because the third core has been found. Under the dark influence of this core, the Taidan have risen under a new leader, a Vega warrior lord named Makan. He calls himself the Sajukar, the Chosen One. Many systems have already fallen under his shadow, and his eyes are set upon Higara. Deep inside the great derelict at Tanis, construction of a new mothership is underway. The pride of Figara. Once more, the exiles will face the coming darkness. This is Fleet Command. Stand by for hyperspace core transfer. Containment unit online. All power signatures in the green. Primary couplings released. Trajectory is good. The hyperspace core is away. Goddamn, Karen, you're still kicking. I thought you'd be dead already. I didn't really expect Higarans to live for about a thousand or so years, or maybe this doesn't take place in. Um, this is Tannis Control. Future. We have visual contact with the core. Proceed with transfer. Trajectory and alignment confirmed. Take it to 115 and initiate capture procedures. recognizes the core and 
starship status report. Engineering online. Stand by to initiate engine sequence. Main engines online. Engine test complete. All standard drives are operational. why they needed to build the second one of these behemoths because they're already setting massive drives to awesome idle. As is. Mothership. Prada Figuera looks amazing. This is fleet intelligence. Our task is to analyze sensor data and generate mission objectives. Before launching the mothership, we must conduct a series of trials to ensure all critical systems are operational. Throughout these trials, the mothership will be running with a minimal crew and will remain docked with Tannis. Once these trials are complete, we will launch the mothership and test the hyperspace core. The first trial will test the resourcing system. A resource collector is standing by. Begin retrieval of resource containers at this location. Oh, okay. Wait a minute, the resource collector is a drone? Aw, I like those giant rectangle blobs. Oh well, I guess the drone is cute with its little T-Rex arms, I guess. Tennis base. Tennis base. Chimera. Station. Mothership. Ooh, look at all these thingies. Mothership. Empty module slot. Hmm. Interesting. Wow. We have a huge selection of stuff. They probably added in new ship types and a bunch of other things. I wonder what type of un new units are actually available. That'd be cool. Cool. Thank you, my friend. You have agreed to help the cause. I don't know why everybody wants to attack the Higarans. It just sucks. You guys are picked on all day long. Live in these giant towers. I can't call them a ship. I, I can't call this a ship. I can't. And what I mean by them, I mean by this and the old behemoth that they had. Like, oh, look at this thing. This is just a, it's just a giant, like, eye. Like, the letter I, I guess. I have nothing really to talk about. This is like 100% stellar commentary right here. Me talking about a ship that looks like resourcing an eyeball. systems well, not eye, fully but operational. The letter I. Ready. Me. Trial successful. Already messed it up. We will now test the mothership's production capabilities. Begin construction of a fighter facility subsystem. Facilities? Mothership. Do you build facilities in this game now? Production underway. All going smooth here. Okay. I think you could do this in the multiplayer when I was testing it out. Yeah, come on. Feed me. Feed me more resources. Mothership. Feed me! You whore feed me! Uh, I'm hungry. Mothership. Mothership. Hmm. I just think this like entire area is crazy town land. Look at this. Giant slabs of metal all over. They're like known as Tannis. Hmm. Mothership. Now I was expecting like a giant like shipyard factory. But no, apparently it's just like this slab. Mothership fighter facility complete. Fighter facility subsystem complete. Oh. Engineering is online and ready for fighter production. To test basic combat capabilities, construct an interceptor squadron. I'm guessing... Alright, so these modules have Mothership. different health requirements. Uh, well, not different health requirements, but different like... Production um, underway. What is it called? What is it called? Um... They have different health bars. Like they don't Mothership. share the same health bars. So I'm guessing you could actually shoot this thing off. That would be cool. Why do the interceptors have five blobs right next to them? Squadron. Oh. So you don't build units individually now. You build them in squadrons. I see. I see. 
See, I thought this was like just a giant piece of metal and that did nothing, but I failed to notice the light bulbs. Dark drones. Interceptor squadron complete. Ah. Stand by to begin combat trials. Oh, there's the interceptor squadron. Perimeter station Chimera will assist by providing target drones. The drones are located here. Use the interceptors to destroy the target drones. Okie dokie, artichoke. Technology has advanced quite a bit, I guess, from where we started off before. I don't know, though. They still kind of look the same. Confirmed. As the, uh, interceptor squadron complete. Destination locked dads. in. Lock all weapons on target. Copy. Acknowledged. All right, interceptors Show go. no mercy. Reporting. Moving to destination. Go, my squadrons. Go. Show no mercy. Understood. Show Attack coordinates no locked mercy. in. Mothership. I'll swallow your soul. Oh, let's watch the people do that. Drones. Attention Tannis Control. This is Perimeter Station Chimera. We have multiple unidentified units detected. Signal indicates bigger bomber strike force. Whoa, the plot is being shoved down the throat faster than I thought it was. Uh, going to be shut down. This is a scramble alert. All pilots to their stations. Chimera Base, this is Blue Leader. Enemy units locked in, awaiting orders. You see, Homeworld 1 had build up, but wow, this thing, this puts you in like. Tannis right is in under there. attack. All forces to combat alert. This is not a test. Interceptors have been launched from Chimera. The enemy must be eliminated. Order what? all interceptors to destroy the Vega bombers. I didn't know it wasn't a test. Reporting. But yeah, this game just like puts you in the middle of it. Kinda cool, I guess. I really like the build up though. Oh, there's Swiggity Swiggity for you. Show no mercy. Back off. Ready for orders. Confirmed. Congrats, guys. But you stopped the. You didn't Chimera stop the... Station oh, is offline. The Vega have breached the Tannis perimeter. The mothership is under attack. Karen, why do you look so tired in your picture? We cannot stay here any longer. Emergency launch underway. Release crews, stand by for emergency launch. Roger that, Tannis. Keep their butts in the Primary service. couplings released. Does look good. Green line firm. The mothership has cleared Tannis. We are away. All right, good. Multiple enemy reinforcements detected. Estimated time before contact: two minutes. Begin construction of attack bombers immediately. Bombers will be required to defend the mothership. If you don't Mothership. Production Listen. underway. It's about like four units of bombers. Why not? Production underway. Standing by. Holy moly. Heavy missile frigate. New ship, I know. Reporting. Mothership fighter facility under attack. Come on, baby fire your missiles. Oh man, 
and I love the trail of smoke that comes out. It's really cool. Acknowledged. Bomber squadron complete. My fighters are doing work, but not enough work. Show no mercy. Okay, bombers, I need you. Mothership. Weapon set to full power. Bombers are Attack definitely doing it. Up. They look like they hurt a lot more. Mothership. Maybe I can't get four vets right now. Missile frigate ready. Anti frigate. All right. Standing by. Copy. Well, you're basically useless against us. But that makes sense because all it has like a uh, large ass bomb. Bomb squadron complete. You can't shoot at ready. Uh, bumblebees. It's like taking a bullet and expecting to shoot a supporting friendly. Oh, actually, yeah. yeah. Three that's, a, three orders. that's a good analogy. Yeah, that's more than I can say for most of my analogy. Drawing light fire. Uh, Roger. Target confirmed. Priority alert. The Vega are using hyperspace gates. If they are not destroyed, the enemy will deploy reinforcements through them. These gates must be destroyed. I already got you, man. Standing by. Taking damage. Under fire. Requesting fire. Confirmed. Engage. Moving to destination. Moving to intercept. Roger. Copy. Bomber and spaces are still complete. doing pretty good, though. So that's good. Confirmed. Reporting. En route. Show numbers. Gate destroyed. Destroy all the remaining hyperspace gates. have detected multiple enemy signals converging on Tannis. All ships initiate docking procedures and stand by for hyperspace. Shit, that's badass. And this is salvos. Holy moly. been destroyed. The Vega have launched a massive invasion. The Garan outposts are falling all across the inner rim. The crew of the mothership is making an emergency departure. And planetary defense systems are standing by. Before we can mount a counterattack, we must rendezvous with the mothership's crew. We will exit hyperspace in the shadow of the Angel Moon. A rally point has been established at this location. Prepare for enemy contact. 